What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's Cole and Jay and Baby Cypress here. We're hanging out here in our sunroom because today we have a bunch of packages here that we want to unbox. Some things from Six Sense Fishing and some things from you guys and we're excited to see what we have today. Cypress pull mommy's hair. Oh, Cypress. <laughs> All day, every day. All day, every day. A little troublemaker. Look how cute he is in his little stripes. He's got his jeans on today. We can't see the jeans. Look at the jeans. Oh. Looking fancy. He's four months old now. Four oh months goodness. old. Starting to try to crawl, but not yet crawling, which is actually a really good thing because we do not have this house ready for a crawling baby nope, nope. <laughs> at all. There's fishing line on the ground. There's fish hooks, stuff, ramps everywhere. We got to watch out. We can't have Cypress getting into that stuff just yet. But we do want to start him young, but we don't want to start him with a hook in his hand. No, no. that would be really sad. Be really sad, really bad. <laughs> but anyways, let's start today's episode off by opening up some things we got from Six Cents Fishing recently. We got this little package here. This was sent to us from our buddy Zach. And in here we have some good stuff to show y'all. Something really exciting. I got these scissors here. We're gonna make the opening process very simple instead of just trying to rip through a bunch of crap like we normally do here. It's usually a mess, isn't it, Cypress? He said yes. What is it? What is it? What is it? He's curious. He's curious. Okay, so inside of this package we have another little package. Oh. And this is Six Sense's new hook bundle. So basically, when you unbox this little package here, you pull out like a dozen packs of hooks. Look at all these oh hooks, guys. Oh my goodness, what? Look at all of these hooks. It's basically one of every version of their hooks. So you start off here, we have the ox flipping hook for flipping. They're soft plastic based like the prawn, the stroker craw. Comes in the five aught, comes in the four aught, comes in the three aught. And then we have the jugular series, just their offset worm hook, five aught, four aught, three aught. And then one of our favorites, the stout wide gap hooks, though with the clout worm, with the flush, you know, any sort of fluke bait, we need a wide gap hook, five aught, four aught, three aught. And then you get some wacky hooks in one aught, size one, and then you get some drop shot hooks. Dang. So basically the idea behind all this hook madness is that if you're like me, whenever I go to buy hooks, I usually don't just buy a single pack. I'm usually buying like five or six or 10 at a time. And uh, Six Cents has made it easy. You can buy all of these in this one package and you get them for a discount rate. Right? I mean, this is a $50 hook bundle and how much is this thing retail? $34.99. So you get all these hooks, 35 bucks. That's $15 off, but you can punch in our discount code CJ10, save an additional 10%. And that's good for everything on the website. So great savings, like another like 350 off. I mean, that's the best deal in hooks that I can think of, and these are super quality. I really love these jugulars and the ox hooks and the stouts. I love them all. They're really great. We haven't missed any fish hardly with them at all. So if you're interested in checking out the hook bundle, go to Six Cents Fishing, click on the bundles tab. They'll have the hooks, and you can load up on these hooks like we did today. Next up, we have another fun package from Six Cents Fishing, and this is one that you are more accustomed to seeing on the channel. This is our monthly Super Six Sack for the month of July. And uh, I have no idea what's in here, we never know, but it seems like every, each and every month these boxes get better and better, don't they, Cypress? They do. They get so much better. So let's pull out these scissors again, let's cut into here, pull these bad boys out of here. Oh, what is it? What is it? <laughs> Cypress is pretty easily entertained. Oh yeah. We love doing these unboxings with them, we love just showing them all these cool fishing baits. Like I said, we're trying to instill all this <laughs> Bass fishing nonsense into his head at an early age, which all he knows is that hopefully he'll want to join us out in the water. So here it is. Here is our bag for July. Feels pretty hefty, feel it. Oh, sorry. Feel it, Cypress, it's, it's soft. You feel it soft. Ooh. Ooh. I love that they come in these little velvet drawstring bags. We have them like all over the place, stacked up here, and we use them to put other baits in. So you can literally just take this with you on the lake or wherever you go, use this tackle box and use the baits you get in your monthly set. So in here, holy smokes, there's a bunch of stuff in here. I already see a big winner starting off. First, I'm going ahead, pull him out, check this out. That boy, it's like the most sought after crankbait in the Six Sense Fishing lineup. This is the Axis Crankbait. It's got that really cool patent pending metal free swinging lip that lets the bait hunt down in the water and it also emits a lot of flash. Um, these baits are really hard to come by and um, I mean, the last few Super Six Sacks have actually gotten one in it. So if you're trying to get one, the best thing to do would probably be to sign up for the Super Six Sack. Great color for dirty water, black and chartreuse. Love that bait a lot. Next up, hey, as if we needed more hooks. <laughs> Some more hooks. You can never have enough hooks. I mean, you can throw up a dollar snags, all these hooks you got. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Some wacky hooks. Those are sick. Next we have, oh baby. Ooh. 
Oh, baby, this is like one of my favorite baits from Six Sense Fishing and one of Jay's too. This is the Divine Hybrid Jig, but it's in our favorite color. I gotta pull it out of the box so you guys can see it real quick. Just real quick, gotta show you guys the color of it. It's that beautiful candy bluegill. Looks just like a bluegill. We use this, we, I actually buy these jig skirts separately and put them like on all of my jigs and chatter baits. It is so good. Love that bait. Next up, that's a killer. We got a bunch of shad coming around here on the lake. 4K shad, Crush 50X. Beautiful little square bell crankbait. This bag just keeps going deeper and deeper. Oh, here's a fun one. Little topwater action, Splashback 70, Black Magic. Jay loves her some topwater, don't you? I do. Little popping action. Throw that thing, as the sun starts to set or early in the morning, she's got some dirty water, just bloop, 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 and then that's what the bats do, Cypress. They come and they slurp it down. You gotta be careful though when you do it with your hands, like these hooks are super sharp. Love that it. it's dressed with a feather treble on the back. We've got another crankbait. How many mm -hmm. things are in this thing? I'm even keeping count. So much stuff. Mm -hmm. Ooh, I love this color. Crush 250 MD. The color is Chartreuse Sungill. I keep having to take them out of the pack because y'all are seeing some glare and I want you guys to see just how beautiful these paint schemes are. It's something that Sixth Sense is known for. If you're not familiar with Sixth Sense Fishing, they have the most dynamite paint schemes in the fishing industry. Look at that. Chartreuse Sungill, baby blue, faded chartreuse, like the little orange spot. Red eyes. Mm. Pretty. Mm. Pretty? Is that your favorite? Ooh. Is that your favorite? Because I don't know yet. I don't know. Which one catches the most fish? Which one catches the most fish? Here we go. To pair up with that hybrid jig, we got a pack of Strucker Cross. What color is that? Watermelon candy. I love this as a jig trailer on these full bodied sized jigs, especially late in the summertime like we're in now. Get on some deep ledges, you know, some offshore humps, some rock piles. That'll do them dirty. And I think we have one thing left in here. I feel like there was 10 things in this in this bag. Seems like it. it does you just seem keep like pulling it. stuff out. Here we go. A classic. A classic. That goes well with those um, those wacky hooks. We got a pack of clout, 5.4. Just a little wacky worm. We got the black and blue styled in this month's stuff. We got the black and blue uh, top water popper and mm -hmm. a black and blue little stick bait for some muddy water action. Want a mustache? Mustache. <laughs> <laughs> I like the way they smell. Good. Got a good scent to them. Well, it looks like that's all we got in this month's snack, but we got a ton of awesome lures that we could probably take out and apply on our favorite body of water. Um, probably today and probably catch the fish mm -hmm. on it, even though we're dealing with some some hot summer blues out yes. there. We haven't really been doing this well the last week or two out there trying to catch the fish. So maybe we need to take some of the baits we got today and uh, try to catch some fish on them. Um, but guys, if y'all are interested in trying out the Super Six Sack from Six Sense Fishing, it's a great deal. It's kind of like that hook bundle. You get all those baits at a discounted rate. And if you sign up for it, and it's your first time signing up for it, you can use our discount code CJSUPER6 at checkout, and you can get your first bag for $10 off, which is a phenomenal deal, in my opinion. Mm -hmm. Give them for the whole family. <laughs> but with that, I think that wraps up the, uh, the tackle unboxing portion of today's video, and we're going to jump into some things that y'all actually sent us this month to our P.O. box. Isn't that exciting, Cypress? That's so exciting! That's so exciting! That's so fun! Dun, 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 dun. Okay, we got this one here. It says J and Cole, and it says it's from Crabs, Soaps, and more. Oh. Crabs, Soaps. Y'all ever heard of Crabs, Soaps? It's the package got busted in the mailbox, but... Oh, looks like some... What? We got some soap! Oh, look it's at laundry. Look at that. 100% coconut laundry soap. <gasps> nice. That smells so good. Ooh. Oh my gosh, Smell I it. love that. Ooh. What is this? What is this? Crab soap hair rejuvenator. There you go. I need my, look at this guys. I've been growing my hair out this summer. Look at this. It is getting really long. You need that. Look at that. I gotta rejuvenate this. It actually, my hair feels pretty good. Sometimes it gets kind of dry and kind of like, feels like it's just splitting on the ends and cracked out, but it feels pretty good, honestly. It feels better than ever. Well, it'll probably feel really good after that. So. I bet so. Next, uh, it's some more, oh, this is lotion. Oh, it's oh. a little slimy. It's a little slimy, a little slimy, but we got some lotion. Ooh. Ooh, we got a bunch of essential oils in there. Beard balm. <gasps> some beard balm. Oh. I'm glad I didn't shave my beard off like I was thinking about <laughs> yesterday. I got on the lake and I got hot, so I just shaved my neck and I'm like, I'm good. We'll save the beard for a little bit longer. Awesome. Beard balm. There we go. That's really nice. Get refreshed. This is an exciting package. I was not expecting this. And then last up, we have some more lotion. It's just some lavender Ooh, lotion. Lavender. 
That's awesome. Nice. How about that? That was a nice little haul right there. All right, so this little care package came with a letter. We have to say thank you guys so much, all of y'all at Crab Soaps, for hooking us up this little care package. Um, if any of y'all would like to check out this little hair and detergent and lotion, lotion company, we'll have a link in the video description for you guys to check out. Huge thanks. We're going to be trying yeah. this out. Hopefully, it makes us feel super rejuvenated <laughs> from head to toe. <laughs> Next up, we have a nice little envelope here. It's from Frank Marullo out of Montana. Wow. Montana. We always get surprised by where this mail is coming from. Mm -hmm. We never know where it's coming from. Let's see what we got here. It is a Montana wild game and fish cookbook with cool. Native American recipes. <gasps> well, look at how cool this is. That is wonderful. That is going to be awesome. I've been literally looking for like a neat cookbook with some new things to try just because you know we, we cook fish and wild game all the time and mm -hmm. kind of do the same sort of things over and over again. So it's nice to be able to branch out and try new things. And this is gonna be awesome. It's gonna have Native American recipes. All right, Frank, so we found your letter deep inside of the cookbook. We just want to say thank you so much for thinking of us and sending us this awesome cookbook with all these neat recipes that we're hopeful to discover very yeah. soon and uh, apply to our cooking. Really excited about this. That's so cool. And next up, we have another big envelope from our friend Lou Lynch. He's always sending us some really cool stuff. Excited to see what we have in this package today. You excited, Cypress? Rare Seeds Catalog. Is this Whoa. Baker Creek? It's a Baker Creek heirloom catalog. It's a 2015 catalog. Ooh. So it's a vintage Rare Seeds uh, catalog. This is um, the company we order most of our seeds from for our garden. So this is really cool. And it's like, it's so much fun when you grow a garden and you plant like unique and rare varieties. It's mm -hmm. just like more interesting. You get things that grow better in your area. And um, you're not limited to like the stuff you, you buy at Walmart or Lowe's or Home Depot. There's just like thousands and thousands of varieties of plants in here that you can use to really make your garden special. He sent a short but sweet letter. It says, I thought this might come in handy for your garden. I believe the company is still in business. Good luck. Sincerely, Lou. The company is still in business and we still buy lots of seeds them. from them. Yeah. They are so much fun. It's so much fun getting these early, like late in the winter time when you're kind of cooped up at home and then just sifting through it, going through it and finding cool things to plant that next spring. So that is awesome. Thank you so much, Thank Lou. Thank you. Next up, we are moving from a package to a box. Medium sized box. Feels pretty hefty. It's Ooh. from our friend Roy Benzinger from Michigan. Cutting here. Michigan. Michigan. I'd like to go to Michigan right now. Probably not as hot. Probably not as hot as Arkansas. We we'll catch some big smallmouth. It's like a dream of mine. I'm sure it's a dream of yours too, isn't it? Oh yeah. Get some big old smallies. Yes. All we got is these these long, <laughs> lanky, lean little Ozark mountain smallmouth. They don't get very big. Cypress still having fun? You still having fun? He said, I'm excited to see what's in that box. Guys, if y'all enjoy seeing Cypress in the unboxing videos or in any of our videos, be sure to give this video a thumbs up. He's such a good boy. <laughs> Look at that, he's got a little spit bubble. Oh. Look at that, it's really cute. Cute little spit bubble. Look at the camera. Look at it. <gasps> Hi. It's like my hair. It's getting nice and thick. <laughs> mm. Yeah, good boy. Oh my gosh, you're so sweet. <laughs> we have the sweetest baby. We got We're so like lucky. having the time of our lives being his parents too. I know. It's so much fun. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we got this box cut open. It seems interesting. Mm. I feel like I've been saying interesting quite a bit. Whoa! What is this? What is this? We got some corn more muffin. muffin. Corn muffin mix. Honestly, it looks like there's a bunch of cooking stuff in here. Ooh. We got a postcard. Michigan wildflowers. Ooh. Look at that. Straight from Michigan. We have got. It's very well packaged. Oh goodness. Oh shoot! Yay! Yes. <laughs> Use that this morning. I know we made some frozen waffles this morning. <laughs> <laughs> this is some pure Michigan maple syrup. Nice. Great A. Amber colored and rich in flavor. Look at that. Straight out of Michigan. How about that? Some good old maple syrup. We love our maple syrup around here. What's this? <gasps> Baby teething toys. That's for you. That's for you. And Aww. he is teething a little bit. Aww. He likes to chew on his fingers a lot. He'll probably just gonna do that yes. in videos. He's just always chewing on stuff. That's awesome. Looks like a little giraffe. Oh. That's cute. That's nice, I guess. We got Clancy's Fancy Hot Sauce Ooh. out of Ann Arbor, Michigan. I think that's local. I think that's what the tag said this is from. 
I think this is from Ann Arbor, Michigan. Look at that. That's awesome. Some hot sauce. I can get down with some hot sauce, guys. Hot sauce. Buttermilk biscuit mix. Ooh. Buttermilk biscuits. Nice. Mm. Gotta have the buttermilk biscuits. And the cornbread. And the cornbread. <laughs> that was fun. Yeah. I mean, I'm not mad at getting some food in the oh, mail. No. Uh -uh. Oh, no. Mm -mm. Food is really great. Nice. Food or condiments, any sort of that stuff. <laughs> That's awesome. That's a lot of fun. I like this card. Look at that. This is the Michigan themed box all around. Look at that. Dear Harkin family, I really enjoy your videos, especially the nature walks where you show us the flora and fauna of your area. It's so interesting. You're such a nice little family. I've kind of adopted you as my honorary niece and nephew. Aww. Sai is so cute and seems like a happy baby. I included some teething toys for him. Everything else is stuff from my home state, Michigan. I hope you enjoy these things as much as I enjoy your video adventures. Aww. With love, Dwayne. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. We really appreciate it. That is so great. Did I say, did I say his name was a different name earlier? I said Roy. It's not oh, Roy, it's Dwayne. Okay. <laughs> it's sorry. not Roy. Dwayne, sorry. Unless Roy's your like alias name or something. Or Dwayne's your alias name. Who knows? Who knows? Thank you so much. <laughs> we really appreciate it. And that leaves us with one final box. One final box. It is a big box. One Moving big on. box. One big box. And I know what's on the inside of it because it says so on the outside of the box. So it's kind of a spoiler, but it's really exciting. We're really excited about it. We are really excited about it. Is it heavy? Yeah, it's heavy. It's heavy. Woo! All right. What? I have got it right here. I'll let you guys read what it says, and then we're going to open this bad boy. Oh, Watch that? out, Cypress. Ready? We got a new barbecue grill! No way. Look at that! No way! Look at that! Unless the box is like clickbait or something. It might be clickbait. I don't think it is that. It sounds like a... Oh, it doesn't sound like a grill. <laughs> oh my goodness! It sounds like a grill. Oh gosh. How do you unbox a grill? I never, don't know! I don't think I've ever unboxed a grill. Whoa! I've always just been just given grills and show up and it's already put together. Oh! Oh gosh. Is that scary? He sound that okay. He sound okay. I'm assuming this is probably like a rectangle shaped grill. And for those of you that don't know, we have a grill at our house. But it's a little janky. We've had it for a while. It's got some issues. We still cook on it, but I almost burn myself on it all the time because it's, you know, handles are off and it's, you know, it's just, it's not what it once was. So this one here, is it blue? Blue? It's a blue grill. Yay! No way. Oh, ah! Freaking Cypress out. I know, but it's a blue grill. Whoa! I'm not going to take it all the way apart, guys. But look at this. It's a blue grill. How oh cool gosh, is that? I love that. Who has a blue grill? I don't know anyone with blue grill. I don't either. We have a blue grill. Oh my gosh. Wow. What? Separate. How about that? This is just a little, little thing on the side. You put your stuff on. I'm making stuff up, but look at this. Ooh. Looks like a little, uh, like a little grate, a little fish yep. grate maybe. You put some fish on that. So it doesn't all flake through and fall yep. through onto the charcoals. That is awesome. I'm assuming it's a charcoal grill. It looks like a charcoal grill. I kind of like that it's not a round grill. You like They're the rectangle? Like, yeah. Yeah. I like it too. It's a little, it's bigger. Like the surface area is definitely larger than the one we have. We can put more food on there. A little tray. That is sweet. That is so awesome. And that is so nice. So this grill was actually sent to us from our friend all the way in Alaska. Or Alaska. Um, the Pitt family, Carrie Pitt reached out to me and said he was going to send us a grill. And I was like, well, you don't have to send me a grill. And he's like, yeah, I'll send you a grill. And I was like, no, you don't have to send me a grill. And he's like, I'm going to send you a grill. And I was like, all right, I'll take a grill. <laughs> I'll take a grill. He said, he said, your grill is crusty. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> it okay. is pretty crusty. It's crusty. So thank you so much, Carrie, for, um, the generous gift. We can't say thank you enough for hooking us up with this new grill and we will definitely be featuring it in one of our future catch and cook videos yes. very soon. I mean, I'm ready to get that thing put together and throw some crappie fillets or catfish or frog legs or something on there. Um, but yeah, that is awesome. And I can't believe it's a blue grill. That's just really cool. So awesome. That's so awesome. Was not expecting Blue's that. Blue's my favorite color. <laughs> and mine too, I think. It's also between blue and green. Probably blue, but blue. bass are green, but water's blue. I don't know. Oh, sorry. It's hard. That's why your eyes are blue. I like blue. Well, with that, guys, we are out of packages to unbox. We just say thank you all so much who hung out with us today during this unboxing video. It was a lot of fun. It's always cool showing you guys some new things that we get. And um, we appreciate each and every one of y'all that takes time out of your day to send us you know, these thoughtful gifts. 
So guys, if y'all enjoyed today's episode, do us a huge favor, hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on any of our future fishing and outdoor adventures. We're Colin J and Baby C, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye. Bye guys.